Hey LEGO fans and welcome back to MB Bricks. Today we are looking at part 17 of my Building Jurassic Park series. If you like this build series, be sure to leave a like and a comment below, as well as hit that subscribe button and the bell icon to see updates to this project when they are posted on Fridays. This week I have built up the front of the lake we completed last week to showcase the towering Brachiosauruses, which are the first dinosaurs seen in the movie. So without further ado, let's take a closer look. First off, I completed this section of the road to the right of the lake. This tour road will take visitors to see the rest of the dinosaurs that we didn't have the opportunity to see in the movie. There was a total of 15 species of dinosaurs who are ready for when Jurassic Park was officially going to open, but the tour was cut short due to the storm. I have expanded the trike paddock a little bit to add in another triceratops with a baby that she is taking care of. The tall electrical fence continues along here, and I am going to build up some mountains here that the fence will line up with. The rest of the landscaping was filled in with lots of foliage. To the front of the lake we have completed a large field where our heroes see the first dinosaurs after getting off of the helicopter. Unsure of what they were invited to see on the island, the Brachiosaurus was definitely a bold choice due to the sheer size of these creatures. I have built up some tall trees that the Brachiosauruses were munching off of, but otherwise the field was pretty bare foliage other than grass, so I haven't added too much other than texturing of green plates. After falling to his knees at the sight of the Brachiosaurus, Alan Grant notices the groups of dinosaurs gathered at the waterhole, or in this case the large lake beyond the field. While I had added some dinosaurs in the last update, I wanted to finish off the area. I'm super happy that we are able to finally get some new LEGO Brachiosaurus dinosaurs, but I do think LEGO missed an opportunity to have the legs articulate so we could pose them in the way they do in the movie as they are feasting on the tree leaves. I have placed them as best as possible to capture the scene. At the very front I have continued the staff road towards this last front section where I will be adding in the helicopter landing pad. I wasn't sure if I was going to have the space for it, but as the front area has expanded, I was able to hopefully save enough space here for it. While this project is nearing completion, I am waiting for one more bricks and pieces order to arrive from Denmark, which will hopefully arrive soon. Once that is here and I put in the finishing touches to this build, including some easter eggs from the other Jurassic Park and World films, then I will be posting the finale. But for now, that covers everything for this part 17 of Building Jurassic Park. If you would like to see previous parts of this build series, please check the description for a link to a playlist of other parts on my channel. If you want to see more Jurassic themed builds not included with this series, there will also be a link to that playlist as well. If you haven't already, please do subscribe as it helps this channel out a lot. Thanks so much for checking out this video today, and until next time, Keep on building.